C++ is only 3%, or with precision, let's say 2.7% more popular than C language, despite being used in millions of games. And currently, we use C language in many important fields. First and foremost, use case is that it is used in most of the election vote counting machines, while very few machines use assembly language. One of the reasons behind using this language is that they are low-level languages which provide direct access to hardware components. And talking about hardware components, you have seen those robot hands in some factories, right? Make a guess which language these robots use. C, right? No, the majority of robot companies have either developed their own programming languages or they use robot-specific languages like Inform, Carol, or Rapid. But most of these robot-specific languages have one thing in common, which is that these languages follow similar syntax as C language. Next use case is very important not only for us as programmers, but as humans, because the C language is used for medical use cases. Do you remember there was a very famous company named BlackBerry which used to build mobiles with 35 keys in it? And I used to think that they only made mobile phones, but now they also create products related to the medical industry under the name of BlackBerry QNX. QNX is the name of their operating system for microkernels. And this operating system is built using C and C++. The second thing is that to build applications for this OS, you have to code in C or C++. You have also heard about Johnson & Johnson, a company which sells diapers. They are also in the same business, and they used to build software using the C programming language. But the sad thing is that they are currently hiring for C++ and not C developers. So my thinking is they have to switch from C to C++ entirely. Moving from this, uh, we have operating systems which are written in the C language, including major operating systems like Linux, Windows, and Mac OS which are used by around 1.8 billion computers around the world. These operating systems are not entirely built using C, but major parts are written in C. Next is space technology, in which C is used by many big companies like NASA, which have used C for the Mars Curiosity rover's flight software launched by NASA with $2.52 billion. One interesting story about this is that a few months after landing on Mars, this robot faced some issues, and to solve that, they rebooted it. And the shocking thing is that it worked. These robots also use MATLAB for data analysis and simulations. Also, the European Space Agency's Rosetta mission software is written in C. For context, the Rosetta mission is for studying the comet from its orbit, so the C language is all over space. Talking about space, there is very little space available on the Earth for cars, and to manage that, we use traffic lights. Many traffic light controllers use C to control the timing and sequence of traffic lights. With this traffic lights, C language controls your car from outside, but it can control your car from inside as well, because C is used in many automotive systems, including anti-lock braking systems and engine control units. It does not stop here. C can control aircraft as well. For example, the F-22 Raptor's flight control software is written in C an open-source maritime chart plotter and navigation software developed by Sailors and OpenCPN. This software is used in ships to navigate and manage the system. There is not much information available about programming-related documents on their website, but I got their GitHub page, and it only contains C language files entirely. So this proves that C language can control everything from road, water, air, and space. But one thing it cannot control is you, and you are only controlled by she not C. So on that note, say hi to your she from my side. Thank you for your time.